My name is Miriam. Welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to be discussing about a chair that I found in the thrift store for $9.99. It's a rattan chair. So I just wanted to change the whole look of this chair and make it fit in my decor. So I will show you. Um, I will show you what I did. Thank you. For this project, I am going to be using a seven, num uh, num seven of these, number eight spline for 316 groove sandpaper to sand the shine of the share and to prep for primer. I need a, um, like a half a yard of suede in grade, staples, a staple gun, spray primer, primer any color. And I tried to three different colors of gold. Um, of course, Gorilla Glue clamps. Um, I got like 10 Dewall clamps to clamp um, the rattan. Here I'm cutting a pattern. I'm tracing a pattern to cut uh, so I could cover the rattan in the back of the chair while I'm so I could prep for painting. Um, I don't want any paint to go into the rattan, therefore I need to cover it. So I created this with two bags, two paper bags, gluing them, um, taping them, so they could just become like the shape of the back of the chair. Um, I use I trace I use a piece of the rattan the only piece of rattan that the chair had um, to trace the shape of the chair here you see that in the front is already covered I removed the piece of rattan now I'm going to cover the back. Here um, I already um, finished covering the back of the chair and now I'm just going to just unbuild it, <laughs> just put it apart so I could just start prepping for painting. I'm trying to remove the um, trim so I could start removing the staples. It was so difficult to do. It had so many staples. At the end, I decided to just cut around it because it was just too much. Um, it would have taken me hours just to remove every single staple um, that, that it had. So, um, like I said, it was really difficult. I decided to cut around it. In those um, here, I'm um, gonna start painting. I cover my stairway and um, I just um, started spray painting. It was a nightmare to spray the to spray paint. Um, it was raining outside for two days. Um, so humid. The smell was in my apartment. So I would never do that again. Um, even though the results at the end are beautiful, but this was really hard to do in the stairs with um, the fumes and just everything. Here 
here after waiting um like six seven hours usually it takes like two hours when it's nice and sunny outside for the spray paint to dry here after waiting like six hours because it was still tacky every time that i touched it i'm starting i start i this here's the first coat of gold um just the first layer of gold paint let's see how long it's going to take to dry <laughs> Yeah, after I dried, I'm just sanding any um, drips or any kind of roughness in the chair. So this is just, this will be my last coat of spray paint. Um, this will be my third. I was able to figure out why rattan is so expensive how time consuming it is just to attach the trim um i could only imagine how long it takes just to attach the actual um webbing cane in the back of the chair um it's just like harder to attach especially to this chair i don't know if it's a flat chair and you could just clamp it it would be much easier but in this case the shape it was just all over the place kept coming out i needed to go back and get more clamps and um at the end i was able to finish it here you can see um the clamps i have um the yellow clamps that i got so i could just get a better hold it was still hard to do i was able to do it and put um trim three times in the front three pieces in the front and I was able to add four pieces in the back 
So now it's finished. Um, it looks complete now. Like it doesn't look like. Here I'm gonna be staining, um, so it could match the other, you know, the back and the the piece of the trim that it had originally. Um, then I'm gonna upholster. I was in between two colors, a brown and a dark gray one. I decided for the gray one, and here is the piece of upholster. Here is the chair, finished. And I'm so happy, it came out so cute. You can see all the trim in the back. It's all seamless and flawless and stained and just beautiful. And that's the bottom, and this is a nice. Let me just turn it this one so you could see now how it looks in the front. In the front you could see here is the back. You just turn it this way so you can see. Here's the front. You can use the poster in suede. Gray suede. Here is the final color. My name is Best Cheer.